प्लीज गेट रेडी फॉर ए डिक्टेशन ऑफ एक्सरसाइज नंबर ट्वेंटी फाइव फ्रॉम लीगल मेटीरियल फाइव सेकेंड्स स्टार्ट द टेनेंसी एक्ट वॉज इनेक्टेड टू अमेंड द लॉ रिलेटिंग टू टेनेंसीज ऑफ एग्रीकल्चरल लैंड्स एंड टू मेक सर्टन अदर प्रोविजन्स in regard thereto by reason of the said provisions having regard to the economic and social conditions of peasants and for ensuring full and efficient use of land for agriculture it was considered expedient to assume management of estates held by landlord holders and to regulate and impose restrictions on the transfer of agricultural lands dwelling houses sites and lands thereto belonging to or occupied by agriculturists agricultural laborers and artisans in the province of bombay and to make provisions for certain other purposes thereafter appearing the tenancy act came into force with effect from 24 1940 land holder means a zamindar or any person not here in before specified who is a holder of land or who is interested in land and whom the state government has declared on account of the extent and value of the land or his interests therein to be a land holder for the purposes of this act agriculturist has been defined in section 2 of the tenancy act to mean a person who cultivates land personally the words to cultivate with grammatical variation and cognate expressions mean to till or husband the land for the purpose of raising or improving agricultural produce whether by manual or labor or by means of cattle or machinery or to carry on any agricultural operation thereon and the expression uncultivated is to be construed correspondingly section 31 of the tenancy act empowers a landlord to terminate a tenancy after giving notice and making an application for possession as provided for in subsection 2 thereof if the same is required by him inter area for cultivating purposes however such option could be exercised in the manner required under subsection 2 in terms whereof notices were to be served by 31 12 1956 section 32 of the tenancy act provides for an option to the tenants to purchase the land in their possession which reads as under tenants deemed to have purchased land on tillers day on the first day of april 1957 every tenant shall subject to the other provisions of this section and the provisions of the next succeeding sections be deemed to have purchased from his landlord free of all encumbrances subsisting thereon on the said day the land held by him as tenant if such tenant is a permanent tenant 
thereof and cultivates land personally or such tenant is not a permanent tenant but cultivates the land leased personally the said provision was amended by maharashtra act of 1961 the amended provision also indicates that the statutory scheme is that the legal fiction contained therein ensures to the benefit of the tiller of the land respondent herein served a notice upon his landlord expressing his desire to pay the purchase price of the land in terms of section 32g of the tenancy act the tehsildar opined that as the tenancy commenced on the date of regrant the tenant ought to have given a notice within one year from the date thereof as contemplated thereof and as such a notice had not been given the proceedings were dropped by order dated 31 1 an appeal there against was filed by respondent and by an order dated 19 11 the appellate authority opined that the provisions of section 32 of the tenancy act were not applicable and the tenant was entitled to purchase the tenanted land in terms of section 32g thereof stop